The GlideScope video laryngoscope is an extremely useful tool for intubating the patient with a challenging airway because it allows the intubator to essentially see around the corner into the posterior pharynx. This image is then projected on a monitor where not only the intubator but his or her assistants can see it. Unlike the Mac, the GlideScope should be inserted into the center of the mouth and rotated over the top of the tongue. This position lines up the camera lens located at the tip of the blade with the larynx. Avoid the temptation to look at the monitor until you've placed the blade inside the mouth and turned the corner into the pharynx. Once inside the mouth, optimally position the image of the larynx in the midline. Don't insert the GlideScope too deep. Insert the endotracheal tube under direct vision, with the curve aimed toward the right side of the mouth. This keeps the tip from tangling with the blade. Once the tip of the tube has passed out of view behind the tonsillar pillars, then look at the monitor. Rotate the tube back to midline and aim at the larynx. Slowly advance the tube through the cords. Withdraw the stylet 2 to 3 centimeters to effectively soften the tip of the tube as you insert. Advance the tube into the trachea looking at the monitor, but remove the glide scope looking at the patient, not the monitor.